Hi students. Okay, today we are learning the topic is equations reducible to exact form. So in the previous lecture we discussing the exact differential equation. So how to finding the general solution of exact equation. Now we are finding non-exact. So first of all the given non-exact equation reducible to exact form. Then out then finding the general solution of that equation. Okay na. So first of all how to convert it to exact form. So what is the definition? What is the procedure? Okay. See that that is equal to here. Okay, sometimes a differential equation m dx plus n dy is equal to zero, which is not exact. So how to check the condition is do uh, n by do y is not equal to do n by do x. So that is a non-exact one. So can be made exact by multiplying with a suitable function is called a integrating factor. There is any function that a suitable function multiplying to the given equation then converted the second form the second form the equation is exact differential equation that is a multiplying the equation uh, multiplying the function is called integrating factor see the definition integrating factor so there is a let m dx plus n dy is equal zero be non exact if it can be made exact by multiplying it with a suitable function that is u assumption u of x comma y is not equal zero. This is an assumption and okay na any function that is must be non non zero. So then the multiplying function u of x comma y is called integrating factor of given equation m d x plus n d y is equal to zero. Okay na so this is the integrating factor of definition of given equation. So note for every non-exact differential equation, if integrating factor exists, then it need not be unique only. And every non-exact in case integrating factor exists, then it is not be unique. And more than one integrating factor may be exist. So that is a integrating factor one of the condition. Okay. So here given some methods are given. Okay, totally five methods to solving non-exact differential equation only. So type one, type two, type three, type four, type five. So in all types, how to finding the solution of the non-exact differential equation? And what is the integrating factor in five methods? And the first of all, finding the integrating factor. So you are given to finding the integrating factor, uh, given some formulas. Using that formulas to finding the integrating factor to multiplying the given equation, then we. That equation is totally transformed to exact equation. Then finding the exact differential equation of solution. Okay, see that first one. Type one. That is a method one. So the method is bisection or formula type. So in this method, integrating factor is determined by the arrangement of terms in in, in the equation, noting that each group. Is a part of the exact differential equation. So, in the given differential equation, directly rewrite and the rewriting the terms of the by using known formulas. That is derivative formulas and so that is a formulas that is called integrating factor. So, in this method, the following total differential can be frequently used. And some formulas are given. I am giving here using that formulas. You have to. Converted the given differential equation uh, in the formula. After integrating, we getting the general solution of the given equation. Okay, na that is equal to here. So that is d of x y and d. So bypass with uh, uv method x into v get. So that is x into dy plus y into dx. So next to derivative of x square plus y square by two. That is equal to differentiation two x to dx here two two cancelled plus two y dy. Two two cancel. That is x dx plus y dy. So next d of x by y, y dx minus x dy by y square. D of y by x, x dy minus y dx by x square. So d of e four x by y, y into e four x dx minus e four x into dy by y square. So derivative of log x y is equal to x dy plus y dx by x y. So next remaining formulas. d of log of x by y is equal to y dx minus x dy by x by y so next to derivative of log of x square plus y square is equal to 2x dx plus 2y dy by x square plus y square 
सो नेक्स्ट वन डेरिवेटिव ऑफ टेन इनवर्स ऑफ एक्स बाई वाई दैट इज वाई डी एक्स माइनस एक्स डी वाई बाई एक्स स्क्वेयर प्लस वाई स्क्वेयर सो डेरीवेटिव ऑफ टेन इनवर्स ऑफ वाई बाई एक्स सो एक्स डी वाई माइनस वाई डी एक्स प्लस एक्स स्क्वेयर प्लस वाई स्क्वेयर सो दिस इज अ फॉर्मुलस एंड डिफरेंशियल फॉर्मुलस यूजिंग दिट एनी फॉर्मुला द री रेट द गिवेन डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन आफ्टर इंटीग्रेटिंग वी गेटिंग द जनरल सोल्यूशन ओके Yeah, first problem here. Solve y dx plus x dy is equal to x dy minus y dx by x square plus y square. So given equation y dx plus x dy is equal to x dy minus y dx by x square plus y square. So using the total differentials, the given equation can be expressed as okay using any formula. Only. So this is the y dx x dy. Which form here? D of x by y only. Okay now. d of x y is equal to y d x plus x d y. So this is equal formula derivative of this total formula tan inverse of y by x n. So that is equal to integrating on both sides. Integrating of d of x y is equal to integration of d of tan inverse of y by x. So integrating derivative cancel end. So integration derivative is a cancel. We getting the solution is x y x y plus is equal to tan inverse y by x plus c. So this is the required gender solution. Okay. So next one. So solve y dx minus x dy plus three x square y square e four x cube into dx. So there is a given equation. Now rewriting. So observing here, man, ki dx ki coefficient only function of x. And to dy coefficient only function of y will com compulsory only in any other terms involving is not get, uh, integrate integrated end. so that is a compulsory dx terms only x terms dy terms only y terms so observing here in the third terms dx so three x square y square e four x by y so here y square is extra term only and y dx minus x dy is also one of the formula using by y square under end. So observing here now dividing by y square, that is equal to dividing by y square on both sides. That is equal to y dx minus x dy by y square is equal to minus e power x cube into three x square dx. So which is equal formula is d of x by y, है ना? So एक आप जो चीज़ ने e power x cube का था. X cube के derivative three x square x derivative dx. So clear. And then this is the e power x form. So minus d of e power x cube and now integrating on both sides that is equal to integration derivative is a cancel that is equal to x by y is equal to minus e power x cube plus c so this is a required general solution okay this is the method one type one so any problem can be can be arranged with the rewrite the terms by using the given differential forms after integrating we getting the general solution. Okay So thank you for more videos please do subscribe my channel like and share it thank you